Hi everyone and welcome to my second channel. What you're about to see is a clip from one of the videos that I have posted over on my main channel but I've listened to your guys' feedback and I know that not all of you have time for the big several hour long deep dives even though a lot of you love them as well. So I'm hoping by breaking down some of those big heavier videos into shorter more digestible clips like this more of you can enjoy them and get a little bit of I don't know education fun interesting passing time stuff out of the clips over on this main channel and if you find something that catches your interest there'll be plenty more clips for you to watch or you can go over to my main channel and watch the video in full. Either way I hope you enjoy and thank you for watching. The image that is appearing on people's screens right now is a jarring one. There are red latex hands clasping what looks like a red toothed latex vagina with the caption virginity is a social construct. As I'm sure you can imagine, people who follow Miley Cyrus on Instagram are probably used to her shenanigans by now. But even so, this particular post did stir up somewhat of a controversy. If we want to be accurate, I would say it's more of a toothed vulva to be fair. You know, the teeth are more like where the labia would be, there's no visible hole, which would be a vagina. I, I would call this a toothed vulva, but you know, I'm, I'm being picky here. It happens. We, in casual speech, often use vulva and vagina interchangeably, and I've done it before. You mix it up, it happens, it's fine. Just thought it was worth clarifying, you know. And you know what? Overall, yes, this image is jarring, but it is supposed to be, because it is a piece of art making a statement. I bet Lauren is also the type to get offended by basically any feminist piece of art. For example, like, think of uh, Judy Chicago's The Dinner Party. I don't know if you guys have ever seen that, but it is an incredible, incredible piece of artwork. I saw it a few years back at the Brooklyn Museum, and basically it's this big, big massive whole room sized art installation with this big triangular table set with all these like beautiful dinner plates, glasses, embroidered tablecloths and each setting at the table is for a different woman, either a figure from history or an important mythical figure or something like that. It is absolutely stunning and at this dinner table on each of the plates except two I think there is the most beautiful elaborate model of a vulva each different because every vulva is different. The tiles on the floor are um, inscribed with the names of different women through history and different influential women. Every aspect of the piece of art from you know the embroidery to the designs on the tables and the glasses and all that sort of thing, each bit is meant to represent a different bit of work or art or uh, something that women have contributed to the world, you know? Basically, it celebrates women, our achievements, our work, our impact on the world, and also our femininity and who we are. And just because within that it chooses to include and celebrate vulvas, that doesn't make it crass or mean there's anything wrong with it. Yes, it's a jarring piece of art, but it's also beautiful and it says so much. But I still reckon Lauren might get annoyed at it. <laughs> I see this post from Miley on Instagram as not quite high-end art like that, but it's still, to some extent, a piece of art that makes a statement. A similar statement, a less subtle statement, but a statement nonetheless about women and our achievements and our rights and our sexuality and our bodily autonomy and how society plays a big part in defining all of those things. 